This is the Tech Freak MB, and I'm again back with a video and reviewing a ROM for Redmi 2. And you can also check for other devices. I'm giving the links in the description. Just check that link. And coming up to the ROM, the ROM is pretty good, and it's also based on the Lineage OS, so it should be good, smooth, amazingly good experience, truly stock Android. But one thing. I'm facing is that the battery the battery is sort of okay I would say not bad as lineage OS but not good as the Tesla and I also use Tesla ROMs a lot back in the days but I don't like their UI so that's why I don't using them right now but uh, the ROM is pretty stable to use as a daily driver doesn't heats up a lot as the lineage OS and uh, I also review a ROM uh, yesterday which is also based on the lineage os but uh, i would say both roms are totally different in terms of um, performance that rom performs better than this this viper rom because this viper rom has little less ceiling on time that's why i'm not using this rom but i have to review this rom because it is good it comes in a list of good roms so that's why i'm reviewing it so now coming up to the customization or the features of this ROM, the ROM, has, the ROM has not tons of feature but it does have little bit of feature which you like it and first thing is that you can see status bar. It is dark, amazingly good but one thing I noticed is that the settings you can see all the settings above it here. The, uh, the brightness light is very uh, lower down and uh, they have given a lot of space between the settings and the toggles so I would say if they are giving like this it's look very bad but uh, I don't know and uh, the second thing I like about this ROM it supports the Lineage's update, uh, updating system like when the OTI updates come you have to go to in the recovery mode and then flash the next update like dirty flashing but this ROM what you have to do um, but you need a root for this um, if you're doing anything, telling anything, you need a root for that system. But in lineage ways, you don't need root. It just uh, works without rooting. But um, uh, when you when the updates come, you have to download it and just tap on install. It automatically install, apply everything, and just uh, reboot it up. But uh, as you need a root for this, so if you have uh, rooted uh, rooted this from, then you can apply updates automatically but if not just go to the recovery menu and flash it it doesn't matter it's as same as you do manually or automatically and uh, this rom comes with two themes like you can see right now i'm using the dark theme of the viper dark theme they call it and uh, amazing good i like the black theme that's i'm using you can see two themes are there light theme is a normal stock android theme and dark theme is the viper dark theme now coming up the other things like nav bars are there there are pixel nav where you can see these are pixel nav other settings are all same as the other roms okay and uh, next thing is i can see you get the pixel icons all the pixel icons but these are not real pixel apps they are just applying some pictures on the old icons so i don't think it's worth to use and I don't know if this ROM supports the Substantum theme engine because the previous ROM supports that and uh, you can check you can give a try to it if, it if it's working then it's good but I would recommend don't use the Substantum theme on this ROM because it's using a pixel uh, custom icons not a real pixel icons okay and because of that there are some problems when you use uh, uh, substant substantum on the uh, substantum on the custom icons because uh, it may crash or it may give some problems lagging or rebooting problems so I would recommend don't use the substantum on this ROM and uh, other thing is that this ro this ROM comes with the pixel launcher and uh, they name it name it as V launcher which is Viper launcher but it has no change you can see it's as same as the uh, pixel launcher and I hate pixel launcher 
a lot and uh, that's why i use the nova launcher prime and i'm giving the link in the description just that's the nova launcher prime launcher and you can use that launcher instead of pixel launcher so that's it in the, that's it in the video and also this rom supports all the new things it has the latest security patch latest i'm going to show you as the proof and uh, you can see here you can see the android version's latest and the security patch and i don't know in this update uh, uh, the update has come on 25th and uh, they have removed the system dates option here but they will be coming in next update so don't worry about it and uh, coming on the camera camera is working volt is also working the big question uh, which everyone asks volt is working on this rom and the most of rom which i reviewed all rom supports the volt e so check my channel if you want to if you want any other rom with volt you can check and um, that's it in the video thanks for watching this is manik and don't forget to like share and subscribe uh, to my channel and uh, thanks for watching this is manik and i'm signing off